our proposal is not putting any additional weight to any taxpayer, to German taxpayer or to any other European uh, taxpayer. We want from the Eurogroup to put in, forms, in force a, a, its decision, which is already existing from uh, the, uh, November of 2012, which says that when the Greek economy has surpluses, net surpluses in uh, its budget, the Eurogroup will decide additional measures for decreasing the uh, uh, Greek public debt, but not putting additional heaviness to the uh, European taxpayers. Our effort is to find a win-win solution a win-win solution in the coming days, and I'm very optimistic that we will succeed it. We well, don't want to, 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 to put weight to the other parts. Right. We want Sir? our economy to turn to the growth. Well, let me come back in then, because um, that sounds great, and you sound like a rational man making a balanced argument. So why do we see the defence minister this morning apparently saying, if Europe is not prepared to play ball, we will go to the USA, Russia or China to look for funding? What is this if it's not trying to put pressure in the negotiations on Brussels and Chancellor Merkel to come up with a plan that suits your government? There is no plan B for the Greek government, for the, for the Prime Minister Tsipras and for the Finance Minister Yanis Varoufakis. Our plan is only the plan A, to become Greece a respectful, equal member of the euro area and of the European Union, having the growth of its economy, reducing the unemployment, putting in force a lot of reforms related with the administration, the tax system, cracking down the oligarchic phenomenon in the Greek economy, which it's a very um, annoying phenomenon because it, it uh, creates gaps in, in the open competition in the real economy. And also, uh, for us, the, the, the crucial point is that we have a program in Greece which failed totally. Our uh, goal is to find a solution common accepted from Greece and from, with, uh, also from uh, our partners. Well, that, that's As a, a vice president sir. of the parliament, I can assure you that the large majority in the European parliament faces the problem like that.